then we come to the next uh, checkpoint of problem behavior under self centered and explosive and this is the last uh, checkpoint under this self centered and explosive behavior of the child and it is uh, talking about the provo provoking the child is easily provoked that somebody providing some stimulation the child gets agitated or child is uh, transport to a negative emotion very quickly it doesn't take much time to uh, change to a negative emotion that is also sometimes referred as short fuse if the child takes no time to change from one emotion to another emotion basically in terms of negative emotion that is called short fuse and those has to be managed with well in the school setup and uh, the practice we should follow in the school setup is called what self i do now we have to check we have to be observe uh, we have to observe very well if a child is reactive very soon after a, stim a stimuli means if we give some stimulation if the child behaves very fast without taking any time the child is angry child is agitated child is showing tantrums child is yelling child is shouting if this happens without taking much time then we keep that in mind and ask the child what shall you do after that stimuli then we as teachers we have to display that what, what we did before. sometimes we teach the children to be responsive rather than reactive to be responding to a situation rather than reacting and this is not a very very big skill if we are aware about the child's behavior to a particular stimuli and we are making the child aware about that and also bring what sal we generally should do if such kind of situation happens if we just display by doing that dem right demonstration then it is not very difficult for the child to accept and take that skill to the way the teacher is trying to display and the teacher is trying to make the modification so that's very very important to do it and it's also very easy to do it but we must have this particular practice very often basically for two things one is our uh, uh, awareness that the child is displaying such kind of uh, uh, emotion after having a stimuli and we are also making the right modification what we should do as response to that particular situation if we follow these two things then definitely the child's behavior is bound to change and evaluation we follow the same thing never if the child is uh, displaying that uh, uh, problematic behavior of getting into negative emotion then we have to give a score of 0 and if it is rarely 1 sometimes 2 and very often a child is showing tantrums and getting into negative emotion we have to give a score of 3 so these are the 11 skills we have covered and uh, important thing is that teachers must keep a note of all these 11 checkpoints and if any child is displaying any of these emotions we have to manage them by adopting right strategy through right activities and right game